Hi all, uh, welcome to my channel. My name is Veronica Pashkovich and in this video I will be putting on a set of volume lashes by Lilac Street in the size 14 millimeters. A couple things to keep in mind when doing lashes or basically anything really is you have to take into consideration the size of your eye, the shape of your eye. A particular look may look one way on me and may look completely different on you solely based on the fact that your eye shape could be different and the width also could be different. Key thing to remember. I do really like these lashes. They are super fabulous and they make me feel super glamorous. So I do like these. I'm very happy with the way they came out. Um, I will have my 20% discount link in the description box below. So you can take advantage of that and get yourself some lashes to try and other stuff. Um, so if you have any questions, please let me know. Okay, so let's get started. So I have my uh, 14 millimeter volume lashes. Okay, that's what I'm gonna be doing. Um, there is, I'm probably not gonna use all of them because they're, super long and they're going to be probably if I do one in the corner of my eye probably rubbing against my um, eyelids so I probably won't do all of them just because of the size um, so all right so these these are the volume ones in size 14 millimeters and then I have my tools and we're gonna get going and also the lilac street I did order I did order the black glue um, and a couple more things from Lilac Street. I haven't yet received my package, so I'm waiting to receive the package and then I will um, test out the black um, adhesive. I hope everybody's doing well during this wonderful, lovely holiday season. Now remember, I don't know if you watched my other videos, but I like to start on the outer corner and go in. Alrighty. And then I'll just do my glue here like this. I'm gonna let it get a little bit tacky. And then I will um, put it on. I always have this habit of opening up my mouth anytime I do anything. We'll get it. It'll get on there. I promise. I promise it'll get there. I do want to mention again, um, based on your eye shape, the way the lashes look on me may not necessarily look the same on you. So that's also important to keep in mind as well when you're buying lashes or trying lashes on. So if you want the same exact look, say for example, as I have, um, don't be disappointed if it'll come out different on you. Um, so that's just a good thing to keep in mind. Cause you know, it's like, oh, I want that look too, right? And then it's like you you go and you try that same look and it doesn't look like that, you know, because your, your shape is different. I think it's the same goes with like clothing even, you know? Maybe like a particular type of pair of jeans looks one way on one person, but may look completely different on you. It's a human thing, you know, we see one thing on someone and it's like, ooh, that looks so good, and then we try it and it's like, <laughs> not for me. <laughs> Ooh, 
looking good. We're looking good today. I'm really liking this look so far. I love the fullness of it. Well, hence, they are volume ones, so. Hence that. Right? So. I'm the type of person is that I want things to work like imminently but clearly clearly it's not working imminently right now Maybe I should put more glue. Ooh, hello. How are you doing today? <laughs> wow, I'm really liking this. So savvy. These may not be glasses friendly, but we'll see. I'll put on my pair of glasses. And I think I'm just gonna do one more. Yep. Yeah, I'm not gonna do all five. And there you have it. This one eye is done. Yeah, I'm not gonna put it in the corner here because it's going to really um, rub my, into my eyebrows and I do not want that. I'm gonna just try to fix this. I like to use my fingers. I'm gonna let it dry a little more and then I'm gonna use my fingers to kind of um, squeeze them down. Um, so I'm gonna let it dry a little bit more. It's looking so nice. I like it so much. I mean, even right now, like when I'm really opening up my eyes, it's rubbing against um, my skin up here. So yeah, so definitely I'm not gonna put the fifth one there. So four of them is more than enough. Okay, so I'm going to do the other eye off camera and I will be right back. And there you have it. I'm on this one. I actually did use all five because there was an area um, that I didn't like. There was like a little, it looked like a little gap. So I overlapped it um, with the fifth one. This one looks pretty darn good. Um, this one actually looks very flawless. This one ended up looking very good, but I did use all five because I overlapped a little gap right in here. So yes, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope um, it was helpful for you. 
um, if you have any questions or maybe any suggestions or maybe things that you want me to try and let you know how I do or how it works for me, um, please let me know. Also, everything that I've used will be in the description box below and also a 20% off discount link with Lilac Street for you to take advantage of as well will be linked all down below. Okay, so this is the glasses check. Um, the length is 14 millimeters, so keep in mind the length of the lashes as well. The longer the lashes, the more potential you'll have for them to touch your glasses, so it's very important. If you are a glasses type of a person, or if you wear strictly glasses and you don't wear any contact lenses at all, like Zillage Zippo Zero, you may wanna move down, instead of using 14 millimeter size, you may wanna move down to like a 12 or, or a 10, um, just so you won't you know, have to feel them rubbing against your glasses. Having said that, with my glasses right now currently, and my size, 14 millimeter volume lashes. The When my glasses kind of slide down and I start blinking, I don't feel them. Uh, they don't rub against the lens, they're perfectly fine. It doesn't bother me really. Um, if I pick up the glasses a little higher up on my nose, um, then I start feeling them rubbing a little bit. Um, if you wear contact lenses, then the size 14 millimeter will be perfectly fine for a particular event or if you just want to feel you know glamorous and fabulous all day long and every day that's totally fine um, i wear both i wear both glasses and contact lenses so i'm able to without worrying or being annoyed that the lashes are rubbing against my glasses i can just pop in my contact lenses um, and enjoy the lashes anytime I want to, um, regardless of the size. So keep that in mind as well. If you are a glasses person, you may want to um, get yourself a smaller size. I would probably go with like a 10 millimeter, between 10 and 12. It depends, you know, on your size and how close you wear your glasses to your eyes, you know, things like that. So believe it or not there are a few things to consider when you know trying lashes and, and things like that trust me i was like what <laughs> really <laughs> i have to think about that seriously out of all things um so do think about that because i don't want you buying you know 16 millimeter glass or lashes and then wearing glasses and you're like oh my god i can't even blink because you know they're super rubbing on my glasses <clears throat> so this is the glasses check like I said again the further down my nose um, they don't rub against the lens when I pick them up like this they will rub just a little bit and also I think it depends on how deep in your actual eye goes and things like that so you know really depends on the depth of your eye and all those things <laughs> if we're getting all technical here um, what else? I think that's it, really. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video and subscribe and like this video. And also everything that I used in this video is linked down below as well as a 20% discount link for you to use with Lilac Street on all the products. And again, thank you for watching.